In this next video we want to find the derivative of arc sine of 2x. And for that we need to remember that the derivative of arc sine, which is also called sine inverse, arc sine of x is 1 over the square root of 1 minus x squared. And we see that we do have a chain rule. We have an inside function. Instead of x, it's 2x. All right, so let's uh, get to work on that. So our derivative of arc sine of 2x is going to be 1 over the square root of 1 minus whatever the inside function is, quantity squared, times the derivative of the inside function, which in this case is simply 2. So we're going to end up with 2 goes into the numerator, square root of 1 minus 4x squared, and that appears to be option D. So again, the difficult thing here is remembering all of the formulas, but once we get to that point, we should be in good shape just applying the chain rule. So you need to know your formulas and you need to know the chain rule, and then this follows from that. That'll be it. For